I started off the day happy, then made a video about Jib's obsession with pregnancy, which is a big story. It's the why she's obsessed and her varying sizes, the why of that. But this is way bigger, you guys. And when I realized this literally a couple moments ago, I literally teared up, okay? This is big. And prepare your heart. If you are human at all, you're going to be pretty sad if you know anything about the real story. Prepare yourself, okay? Go ahead and look in front of you. And now, with the way this setup I have is going on, it's hard for me to see it. So go ahead and zoom in if you can, read along, or bear with me. Um, but online, this is just basic information about the Stephen King movie, Rose Red. In my opinion, Gypsy based her unaliving of her mom on this movie. And unfortunately, get your heart ready. Everything that's happening now, 2015 till now. So in this character, it shows basically the character and then who played it. So here we, we see Professor Joyce was being played by Nancy Travis. That's a pregnancy story right there, but that's a video you can watch after this if you want. Um, but this is bigger. So go ahead and look where the tan area is. I've highlighted it for you. Oh my goodness, it's so hard to tell you guys this, okay? Um, God, I'm going to cry again. Annie Weeder. Kimberly Brown. An autistic teen who has telekinetic abilities, is accompanied by her sister, Rachel Milani Linsky, Emery Waterman, Matt Ross, Nick Hardaway is being played by Julian Sands. So the character Nick is being played by Julian. And then it says Victor Kadinsky being played by Kevin, I believe. But the bigger story is the Nick and the Victor. Now, Victor was the name Gypsy assigned to Nick's dark side. Get your heart ready for this. When she... Let this sink in. I know it's, it's tough to realize this. Take a deep breath. When Gypsy was looking for the perfect Nick who needed to be Christian, who needed to be autistic, according to the, the movie here, you see the autistic teen is at play. He had the mind of a teenager. He was autistic. His name needed to be Nick. In my opinion, this is what's going through her head. And imagine when she meets the perfect Nick, finally, who's autistic, who's the perfect Nick for her to do what she wants to do with. She gives him the name Victor for his dark side, his vampire side, the side that would do the unaliving. And what name do you see just right by the name Nick on this list? The name Victor. Now, I guarantee you, when Gypsy watched this movie and planned everything and based the act, the scene on this movie, in my opinion, she knew that she was going to pick an autistic man who needed to be named Nick. And she knew that she was going to give them a character role named Victor. And if you're crying and you're human, thank you for your support. Thank you for watching. And please share this. And please send your love to Nick Go to John.